Hey, my fellow multidimensionals, it's Aisha Love, founder of Multidimensional You. It's been a long time since I've done one of these interdimensional race relations, uh, interdimensional Sasquatch and little people videos, but I am in Grand Teton National Park and I was out here the other day hiking and came through this area and a butterfly came and hit my shoulder, really got my attention, that's never happened before. And while I was looking that way, I got tapped by somebody on this shoulder, classic prankster move, right? And so they got my attention. And this is, um, this would be my tall <laughs> forest friends, sometimes referred to as the ancient ones, interdimensional Sasquatch, very different personalities, the world over, um, mainly in North America is where I've interacted with them. And the contactee who, who got a hold of me here is a very tall male who is more on the lighthearted, fun loving prankster end of things. But there is a whole group here and they know who I am. So they clocked me and made a point to reach out. And in return, I asked for a white feather and uh, there are no white feathers. I've not seen one the entire time I've been in Yellowstone or in the Grand Teton National Park. And then I put my feet in Jackson Lake, sat down on a rock to put my boots back on. And I looked down and there was a white feather right between my feet. And so here is that feather. <laughs> Exhibit A. Thanks, guys. And so beyond sharing some of these fun stories, which I did uh, on my fireside chat video series from, gosh, beginning, I think in 2017 or 18, I have all these amazing stories of the gift exchanges we've engaged in. The point of this series is really to begin to bring our peoples back together and to build, uh, break down walls of fear and prejudice and certainly the idea of our Sasquatch friends as any sort of monster. They are very evolved sentient beings with incredible multidimensional capacities. And so this series is designed to help, you know, educate people and encourage you to make your own friendships. And so we'll cover some etiquette, uh, what I do when I'm entering a space. Uh, I always ask permission before I go into a, a wildland. I just always check the energy, make sure I'm welcome there. And um, only once or twice have I been told not this time, please just respect that. And of course, I turn around and I'll go somewhere else. Um, for those of you new to the channel, multidimensional reality is like a a large ecosystem, just like we're familiar with our planet and environmental ecosystem. It just happens to involve different uh, dimensional zones or bands of frequency. And our physical eyes are designed to perceive a certain limited band of frequency. Our pineal gland and the, you know, the often called the third eye has rods and cones that can perceive light from other dimensions. That's why many of us are experiencing psychic effects. And so, for example, one of my experiences years ago was in Montana and I psychically saw the face of a Sasquatch man flash in my mind's eye and then heard the vocalization out in the woods. And he vocalized maybe four times louder each time. We heard him walk, splash through the creek below. But a lot of it is what we would consider mind speak or telepathy. Uh, right now, our friends here invited me to this very specific spot. I even tried to go further back. They said, no, right here is ideal for us to be able to communicate with you and through you. So I've invited them to do whatever effects they want on this video. Maybe they wanna leave a voice overlay uh, sometimes they can leave imprints of their voice on your audio recordings if you just leave them running. It doesn't even have to be heard vocally. I'm not sure how they pull that off, but they do, as well as any sort of screen flashes or uh, they'll often bring hawks overhead or ravens, as well as, you know, like the butterfly effect. <laughs> and I'm sure many of you have your own stories. Please feel free to share them in the comments. I just see this series as, a, as a, just a wonderful place to share some magical stories and build friendship and you know through gifting in the past many of you have heard my dolphin story we'll make sure the series is public again and just keep adding to it as time goes on so let's get to anything that they wish to bring through because i am a multi-dimensional channel and they just wish to bring through this message around we see you and we see how many of you because they're showing me they watch hikers come through here we see how many of you are struggling and how much your hearts hurt and they wish that they could alleviate that. They wish they could help with that more. And they're actually inviting humanity to come to them for heart healing, very specifically. So feel into that right now. You may have your own heartache, 
maybe recent, maybe from a long time ago, some old grief you might be sitting on. And go ahead, yeah, there. I don't know if you felt them clock in with their energetic presence. It's very strong. Yeah, they're connecting and feel their beautiful healing that they're bringing through. Not even through me. They're just bringing it straight through the screen, or through this experience with you. It's beautiful. As I receive their healing, it almost feels like when you unplug the drain and just all the water can just go out. It's like a any sort of like heavy feeling that's all just leaving. It's draining away. They're showing me specifically for myself and many others, many of you, you're all healers yourself, follow this channel. Um, as children, they're showing me, we took on a lot of other people's emotional pain and sadness, especially. Yeah, there we go. Even more is going out. And even a sadness for the state of the world. As young children, wide-eyed, open-hearted, it can be shocking to come to a planet where there's such coarseness and maltreatment of one another still. So just let that keep going. Yeah, and as that does that, then there comes this ever effervescent, like, chaser. <laughs> yeah, this guy here especially, Tully, is what he told me to call him. He's got a really good heart, a wide grin, and a big belly laugh. He's, yeah, I got it, okay. He's like the Santa of Sasquatch. <laughs> right? Yeah, ho, ho, ho. That's great. Oh my goodness. That's beautiful. I'm hesitant to share locations, except that I will say that this is in the Jackson Lake vicinity. And for those of you who are shamans and healers, you, you will find your way. You will find your way. You'll be guided if you're meant to connect. But it's really not necessary to come here. Uh, this is going to be you know, winter wonderland pretty soon. It's really about in your corner of the world making contact. And the interdimensional Sasquatch people and the little people have, you know, they're all over the world, known by different names, of course, and different continents, but they're everywhere. And it's time. I mean, look at the beautiful healing we just received. This is what we can contribute to one another and live together and coexist beautifully and evolve together. We are one after all. Okay, well, thanks again for the feather, guys. <laughs> thanks for the healing. Thanks for the connection. Thanks for contacting me, making an effort. And thanks for the friendship. I invite you all to share your stories below. Um, again, in this channel, we're normalizing multidimensional reality, including friendship with our interdimensional friends and allies. And hey, if you're looking for a high vibe tribe, we are doing some amazing things in something called the Higher Love Family. It is a lot of amazing higher love alchemy that I was directed to start bringing out in uh, the middle of 2024. And I've frankly just been mind and heart blown at what has come through in terms of activations and helping all of us keep in sync with this fast moving ascension. So that information is below. And of course, if you would like personal help, uh, depending on my schedule, I may have availability. All that information is below as well. I love you all. Have a magical multidimensional day.